Apple has released iOS 18.1 RC, which means that the highly anticipated hearing assistant feature has arrived with your AirPods Pro 2. Let's go through the setup process together. Firstly, wear your AirPods Pro 2 and go search for hearing assistance in your AirPods settings. Choose Take a Hearing Test, Get Started, and make the necessary selections, then hit Next, so that we can get the test starting. You will be asked to go to a quiet place so that you can take the hearing test effectively. If there's too much noise, you will see an indication on your iPhone. If not, you will see noise is OK. Now you need to wear your AirPods Pro 2. Of course, uh, have a good fit on your ear. The iPhone will check if the fit is OK so that uh, you can get uh, the hearing test correctly. If it's okay, you will see these uh, checkboxes and hit next. Do not disturb, it will be automatically on during the test, of course. That's a really nice addition. Some instructions. What you need to do is tap on the screen each time that you hear a noise. So each time that I hear a noise, I'm tapping on the screen. This measures my hearing. This works in a similar way as a third-party hearing test. If there's too much uh, noise during the setup process, you will see this indication on your iPhone, and when things go back to normal, you will see that noise is okay. Now you will uh, continue with the left ear, and once it's, uh, everything is okay, you will continue with the right ear, so that you can uh, uh, take the test for both of your ears. Once the test is completed, you will see your hearing test results, this will also be available in your uh, uh, health application, in the hearing section. You will also be asked, once you complete the test, if you want to enable hearing aid. Of course, it takes some time uh, to get used to the hearing aid. It might be not, let's say, uh, obvious if your hearing is okay, but if you uh, need uh, really uh, support, then I understand that it's going to be, let's say, uh, more difficult for you to get used to it at first. You can also add a relevant control on the control center, the hearing control. I suggest you to do it. And then once you open it up on the control center, you can adjust the settings without being able, uh, without being necessary to go to the settings. This is really nice. Of course, there are a bunch of settings that you can also uh, adjust once you enable hearing aid on your settings how intense you want it to be. One thing that I noticed is that the active noise cancellation works so much better after I take the hearing test. Uh, it works really nice with calls, really nice when I listen to the music, to a podcast, and there's background noise. I've, of course, I haven't tested it really thoroughly because it just was uh, out yesterday. But the very first impressions are really, uh, really good. You can, of course, uh, disable hearing aid at any time and enable it uh, back later. Thanks for watching, guys. If you found this helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell for more tips and tutorials. See you in the next one.